I'm in one of my favorite hotels. I'm sorry, but that was the best thing ever. Hello everyone, welcome back to another haul. I'm so in my element showing you these bits here. Um, it has been so busy, so this is my first video I'm going to pop, I think, which is a really fabulous video. I've got the um, this amazing haul with so many luxury things, some really fab sal finds, like 30% off, like Prada and some of my favorite brands. Um, I've also included some old bits because I don't like always showing you new things. I like sharing some things that I've had like for two years that I'm still wearing and they're still in stock, like classic fit investment pieces. So I'm going to show you this. Then I've had to, I have had to write a list. Oh, then we're going to see the Paris vlog. I've literally got a memory like a goldfish. Then we're going to see the Paris vlog, which is an amazing vlog. You're going to want to watch that mainly because... Um, I went with a brand, which you're going to see, but they took us to the best places, lunch, dinner, Eiffel Tower views, one of my favourite hotels in the world. So you're going to want to watch that purely for, why is this a terrible angle? Purely for um, seeing like the best places to go in Paris. It's going to be so helpful. Um, what else? I'm going to do like a little child unboxing of some really fabulous things that I got for Honoré recently and then in the next haul I have like me doing a photo shoot at the Ritz I have a new Hermes bag that you're going to want to see and then I've got a fabulous high street haul and Paris really spoiled me when he never buys anything so they're the vlogs that are coming up do subscribe now uh, let's get straight into this Louise Vioroma is a brand that I've worked with for around six seven years um, always love shopping there, their shipping is amazing, I always find their shipping quicker than most places in the UK, literally, never have a problem, they've got their reward style, reward style? They've got their reward, customer reward program, um, where your, your money that you spend turns into points, and then that, those points are redeemable, and I always put my points towards, like a pair of Manolos, something classic that I get really huge discount off. So it's, it does go in your favour to keep shopping at the same places. So the first piece we're going to get into is this Zimmerman blouse. I always end up buying a Zimmerman piece one or two a year. And I do try and avoid that. Like, I always am so transparent with you. I don't like buying lots and lots of Zimmerman because I feel like... I feel like I want to try and shop other places that I can get my money's worth. I like to spend my designer money money on designer on ready to wear pieces like, you know, the shoes that I'm about to show you, the accessories, jackets, so many cool things here. And then I only buy like one or two, but they're good. And they're pieces that I can wear like in the autumn as well. Like how nice is this for autumn with a pair of leather trousers? But then it's a bit autumn-y, but then put it with a bright orange bag, which I've worn it with in all of the cutaways, you'll see. It's very summery with a white pair of jeans. I always go for cold sets. I've got the shorts for this because then you can wear like a white blouse with this or, you know, oversized denim jacket. So that's that piece. I, I put all the size references below. I just really love the colour. Baby blue is my favourite colour. And I find that with the Zimmerman blouses, they're really good cost per wear from, for me because I actually wear these all year round. But then I've got the shorts to go with them to create a whole look. But then I can also pack the shorts on a trip or like literally have them in my wardrobe. And I can wear that with a linen white blouse, a black lacy blouse. I feel like I get a lot of cost per wear out of them. So that's these. Uh, that little set. I wore that at the Ritz the other day when we went, we did a shoot and then Paris and I went for a nice lunch on the terrace. Now we'll talk about this. So this is actually menswear. So that's one thing I really love about Louise Vioroma as well, that I can do all my shopping, but then I'll pick up something for Paris, whether it's a pair of trainers, they have the best kids wear stuff. Always got everything in size. The price is really good. I find it crazy with kids designer stuff. Like some of the sites, the prices are really crazy but Louise Uroma always does the accurate price they also do homeware which you've seen me buy things from there before my feather lamp is from there I always pick up like my Lacresse um 
like saucepans are from there. I love it that you can get designer everything, home, kids, men, and I always also buy menswear for myself. So this is the Prada denim jacket, and I've said so many times that you should check out menswear. Um, it's really good for Christian Dior and really good for Prada because this was when the cropped one was out of stock. They had every size in the menswear, and it was cheaper, and as much as I love that cropped one, it's not, I do love it more now, but at the time I think I was carrying more baby weight and I just wanted something different and I wanted something not cropped. And then I was just looking at Prada on Louise Roma and I ended up getting this. So always check out the menswear. Um, and this is just something that I've had for a while and I always wear it. It looks so good with this. I wore it with my Prada jeans that you know I just live in. So that's that. Um, I'm not sure if I filmed anything with that, so I'll put up a couple of pictures. This is my Kate Cashmere. Well, it's very bright. My Kate Cashmere, I have it in grey that I got it at the beginning of last year and I actually throw it on with everything. Kate is very pricey, but everything I have of Kate, I wear over and over again and it's like go-to for work, for meetings, just every day. They're comfy, they're good quality. And I just wore this so much that I thought I've got to get the baby blue. Uh, I do think it's worth the money when it's cost per wear. This one is not that bad price either. But at the moment, Louise Roma have some insane 30% 30, 30 off discounts. And I'll put a star next to it. Like a lot of this is in, in the south. Now this is the... I got this one first. I love the colour so much that I got this one. Now this is the famous Kate Cardigan with the ultra long sleeved but this is the new style that's a bit longer and I do love the shorter one because it's really good with dresses it's just really good to have a shorter version it's not cropped but it's shorter um, and I also like this one so I, I can't really choose my favourite which is why I've got this other one because I just wear them all the time I've got the cream the black and the brown I wear them all the time they're just they're just something about them that just looks so good. And again, they're so expensive. I put off getting one, just one, and I wore it so much that I then got two in a different colour. And they're just my go-to whenever I travel, I go on a press trip, whenever I go to a meeting, I just throw them on and it just looks like an effortless look. And they're warm, they're just amazing. So I picked up the blue one. They've always got a really amazing selection of Kate at Louis Roma. Then I picked up this. This is one of the 30% offs. And I was toying between black cream, black cream, but I know that I, I love an all cream look like with my white Chanel, with my Cray Birkin. I just love that all white look. I wear, wear it with my lemon Chanel. I wore this in Paris with a pink Chanel bag. I then wore it over the weekend, literally this Saturday, and I wore it with my white Chanel bag. I think I've got a picture that I took in the mirror. It was funny because parrot, I wore black knickers with these. I always get showered and then I'm either running the house, running around the house in my knickers or a robe trying to get on array ready. And I didn't know what I was going to wear. And then by the time I threw on my dress, I forgot I had black knickers on. And he just let me walk around the whole day with a pair of black knickers. But if you've got a pair of nude knickers on, it's not transparent at all. It's just that I had jet black knickers on. Nice little story for you. So I love this so much. I'm going to pick up the black one, especially because it's 30% off. It's just a very chic, comfortable. I wore it with huge Jimmy Choo heels for a dinner in Paris, but then I wore it the next day because it was planned to be for my next day outfit with my sliders, which I'm going to show you in a second, that are quite controversial. I've had so many questions about them, so do hold on for that. So yeah, if you're looking for... Um, just a nice knitted dress, very, very good price. This is the one, black is amazing. There's so many pictures on my Instagram, by the way, wearing all of these. So Blaze Milano, I have so many of these, I've lost count, they're just excellent tailoring. Oh, what's happened there? Excellent tailoring, excellent fit. I normally go up a size and get a size three, because I, like I don't like my blazers fitted. Um, this one, they only had a size two, which fits me fine. It actually makes a nice change for me to have a bit something fitted. But if you are looking for a really fabulous blazer brand, check out Blazer Milano. They're an Italian brand, Italian, tail Italian tailoring, made in Italy. Um, and Luisa Roma being an Italian brand, they have always have amazing stock. I have so many, but this is the latest one. So chic and just simple, amazing blazers. 
Now, Prada jeans. Prada jeans have become my favourite. These ones I live in. I always have the boyfriend jeans of these. I'll link them below, but they're always sold out. Probably sold out. Then I come across these, because these ones that I have in, I've been waiting to see um, anywhere if Prada brings them out in black. I really want them in black. Just any colour, basically, because they're so amazing. And they've only got them in baby pink, which are actually on my wish list. Haven't worn these yet, as you can see. But these I saw on Louise V. Roma and they were 30% off. And the price was a little bit cheaper to begin with than these because I think they're old season. So these ones that I have are quite short. They're not cropped, but they're just dead cut, like little bit cropped. Whereas these are full length ones. So I thought, oh yeah, I could quite fancy them. Like wearing them with heels. I could always cut them like and put my own seam in it. You know, you can even take that at the dry cleaners, which will do it, they'll do it for like £12. It's very easy to do yourself. So picks up a pair of Prada jeans for 30% off. Like, and Prada jeans just fit so well. Top tip when it comes to dark denim, you have to wash dark denim before you wear them because this is the dangerous colour for colour transfer on leather seats. Uh, light bags you have to wash these use a dark wash a color grabber wash them on their own or with other denim because they will ruin your other clothes i always get a bit scared of this color denim myself but as long as you put them on a wash wash try and drain the color out as much as you can then start wearing them that's why i haven't worn them yet because i, I want i need to wash them then it brings me on to these i, I use my own points with these I bought them, they come just before Paris. I have so much to answer about these because like, my DMs went wild when I shared them. So how nice these two denim together. Now, these have been very popular in the classic Gucci like monogram print that I'm a huge fan of. They were sold out when I went to buy them. Now they're back in stock. I actually love, love, love the denim because I wear so much denim and so much blue that I absolutely, I'm glad the other ones were out of stock, but they're in stock now. So I had so many messages about these saying, oh, my friend got the, someone said to me, my friend got these and they've ruined her feet. They're so uncomfortable. And I wrote back saying, oh no, they're so comfortable because I'd literally just tried them on in the house to see if they fit me. Walked up and down, fine. So I'm going to be brutally honest with with these because I would never say, oh yeah, they're so comfortable, get them, and then you get them and then you never trust me again. I'd rather say, I'd rather tell you the truth and I'm very particular when it comes to shoes because I cannot, I cannot deal with anything uncomfortable just for the sake of fashion. No, 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 no. So, right, I put them on at home, so comfortable. These are so comfortable even after wearing, oh, I shouldn't actually touch the bottom because I've been wearing them in Paris. Let me hand sanitise now. Then I wore them in Paris and it was hilarious because I was shooting some film with, with Hannah and it, they're hilarious. I was literally walking like this. I could not walk in them and I was saying to her, how have these been approved? How can anyone walk in these? Comfortable, but almost impossible to walk in. Then I had no choice, which I'm glad because the, then we had to get in the car and go out for the day. By, after like two hours I'd got the hang of them and it's just that they're a bit heavy not I've had heavier but the the leather here and the molding on the leather they're actually quite they are really comfortable there's no sharpness for me they were just really heavy but after two hours I just I have got extremely skinny feet as well so that doesn't help if you haven't got skinnier feet if you've got like normal to wide feet these would be really good if you've got skinny feet for me you just have to like learn to grip and then a couple of my friends told me to get the grippers here and then they'll be really fine. I probably don't even need them because actually after two hours I got the hang of them. I loved them. They're a little bit heavy but all Mews are. But they give me a nice bit of height. The price is excellent. All of the shoes that are similar to this from other brands, you know like Chanel, they're a thousand or over a thousand. That's a super brand though, but even the other competitor brands, they're a lot more expensive. I think under £500 for a pair of shoes like this is actually incredible. And I even got them cheaper because I used my Louise Via Roma points, I converted them to cash. So I love them so much that I'm actually going to get the, the brown pair as well. So my conclusion for these shoes they are not uncomfortable they're just a little bit heavy to work walk in and I can't say the same for the white multicolored ones or the other ones because they might be slightly different these ones are amazing I don't want to them now actually because they'll make me even taller this little outfit which I haven't worn I've tried it on and I took like a little 
uh, selfie, so I put that up. I love lemon. I have a Chanel lemon jacket, a Miu Miu le le lemon jacket. I love lemon. I think it's so great on all skin tones. My favourite skin tone for lemon is dark hair, black, brown, caramel skin tone, very dark skin tone. You look the best in lemon. I don't even have the best complexion for lemon. But pick this one up from Alexander Rich. It comes with a matching skirt and it also comes in other colours. Um, but I didn't get the matching skirt. I actually got this dress, which I, I was a little bit scared of because I'm very conscious of my arms. But I'm really trying to embrace um, sharing my arms and I should really work on them as well. But then I've got the jacket for when I feel conscious. This is just so elegant and this is 30% off and it comes in two other colours. Um, and I just love Alexandra Rich. It's like like a like a old fashioned traditional with a modern twist with like kind of the accessories and accents that go on them. But I wanted to show you this. It's just a timeless, elegant dress. It looks so good, the pair together. Uh, but definitely check out the jacket to match this, the other colours in this, but also the skirt to match this as well. Um, lastly, I have two accessories to share with you. These are old. I just wanted to highlight that Louise V. Roma do the best Nona Blahnik collection. It's my go, apart from the Gucci mules, I always, with my points, just invest in a pair of Manolos. They've got the colour that I really, really want at the moment. I'm waiting to build up my points again and then I can hopefully still get them. They've still got my size. I'll link the pair that I want in stock. No one else has the colour as well, by the way. So if you're looking for Manolos, really good selection on Louise V. Roma. I'm just, I'm trying to encourage you to shop on the same places so that you can build up your points. And then also you get invited to like VIP, which there are incentives on shipping and like that you get to see releases before they come out. Now I can't forget my new Gucci purchase. I am obsessed with these. I have wanted them for so long. They're the low heel Gucci monogram print shoes. I have been um and ah and about these and I can't believe I didn't buy them sooner. I just think they're so classic. They are so incredibly comfortable. I have lived in them. And with my Gucci tights, it's such a moment. I'll try and find them to link, but they're sold out everywhere. These just go with everything. The, you know, I wore it with a white dress and my tights. They go with jeans, black split leggings. Can't get enough of them. Um, and true to size, love, love, love. I want to show you before we get onto the Paris haul. Oh no, I'm gonna quickly show you the kids stuff, but that's really quick. Um, is this, again another Alexandra Rich piece, it's choker, I have shown you this before but I absolutely love it, so nice isn't it, um, I think that's gone to 30% off as well. I'm going to quickly show you some kids bits, so child salon, um, I have worked with them in the past but I'm just showing you this, I don't have to show you but um, some really amazing bits that I got from child salon, they have the most amazing pieces for, for kids. Um, I'm not sure if I can get you a discount code. I will ask and if I can it will be in the link in the description box below. I don't think I I don't think I can because this is not a like collaboration. But I got him an outfit for Jubilee because they have some really amazing British brands and the I actually looked because I wanted these for Honore's christening but they didn't have his size um, and then they did have his size, uh, but I had left it too late and it was literally the day before. It was a Sunday and I went to town on Saturday to try and find a pair of white shoes. It, I could not believe that no one did cute traditional shoes like this. So Child Salon is really good for all the traditional bits and the shipping was really, really amazing. Made in Spain. Aren't Spain like the best um, for shoes and kids wear? Um, but anyway, these, these are what I wanted for his christening. I ended up getting him some like jelly shoes last minute, poor thing, but I wanted these. But I got them in the end because I knew that he would wear them all the time. And these. So back in the day when I was young, you could, you could just, these, these were in high street stores. Like this was the shoe for children. Not one high street store or any store for that matter had these kind of shoes for kids. I could not believe it. I love all those. English royal traditional looks for Honoré, it really really suits him. So I picked up them, I'll show you a couple of pictures and see if I've got any cutaways but how cute. I just love these, even for every day, now I just put a t-shirt on him but he looks smart but super casual. 
um, this shirt, it's actually a whole set, but we put this on him, Beatrice and George is such an amazing brand by the way, the price at Beatrice and George is so, so fabulous, I'm used to paying quite a lot of money for his kind of regal outfits, and I, I discovered Beatrice and George on Child Salon, I definitely recommend it, the prices are so, so good, like, honestly amazing, so anyway, he put this shirt on, and he literally looked like he was like, off to work at JP Morgan or something, because when Paris used to work at the bank, the longer you've been there and the more established you are at the bank, the more that you wear like an open shirt like this and a pair of chinos. Like the last couple of years that Paris worked there, he would never wear a suit or a tie. That's kind of when he started out and he just literally to me looked like a little, little banker or something. So the cutest little outfit and he loved wearing it all day. It wasn't uncomfortable for him. I just have to show you it's such a gorgeous little brand very very well priced and then I just put a pair of long socks on him he we're going out for lunch tomorrow and he's wearing this so I think by the time this goes up I can put a little picture up of him I love soldiers for him um this is one of my favorite brands Rachel Riley I buy it Rachel Riley for him all the time award-winning luxury brand for children is a beautiful brand I'm sure you've all heard of Rachel Riley and then I have another um, one more outfit, this is what he wore with the cream trousers, and they did this in baby blue, um, this brand was so well priced, Pow and, Pow and, I can't see, I honestly need glasses, it's getting out of control, I literally can't even read things that are small, I need, I need to book that appointment, I'll link everything below, my, this is that been, I've been on my laptop all morning and they've gone ultra bad today, so they had this in baby blue, but I always buy him baby blue. He's got so many sailor outfits and they're always in baby blue or navy. So I thought this was really, really different. And because he's got greeny eyes, green actually really suits him. It's just a nice change to get mint. But how cute is that? And they're just all pieces that are really well made and comfortable. Really good fabrics because he's he's got really, um, really sensitive skin like me. So I just wanted to show you those. Um, and there's also a sailor look how adorable he's also got a sailor like play suit we're going to be wearing that on on friday when we go to london and also for our next holiday but i will link it below because it is the cutest little boy or girl's outfit ever but that that's it there um so that's the haul everything will be linked below all sizes will be linked below now i'm going to film the hermes unboxing and what else am I doing? Oh, and the, the presents that Paris bought me for our anniversary. So do make sure you subscribe. Enjoy the Paris video. The Ritz... What am I talking about? No, you're not seeing the Ritz vlog. That's, to, that's in the next video. You're going to see me going to Paris. So enjoy Paris. Do subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. <sighs> it's been a long time since we've seen each other. Um, and I'm in Paris and I'm so happy. I can't even tell you. I'm in one of my favourite hotels. Oh my goodness, it's getting better and better. I'm in one of my favourite hotels. I would say in the world, like this is literally one of my favourite hotels ever. And I'm here with Sicily. And I was so happy to be at this hotel. But I walked in and saw this. <gasps> and I don't know if the other girls have got different colours. But as you know, baby blue is my favourite colour. I'm so happy to have this. Oh, the rosewood. That's how our itinerary. I'm here with Sicily. Oh, look. Oh, wow. Oh, look. Oh, look how beautiful that is. So, this is my beautiful room at the Creon Rosewood Hotel, which is one of my favourite hotels. I've stayed in this hotel a couple of times with work. But this. Oh wow, um, look at this, oh, oh, I'm sorry, but that was the best thing ever, I'm so glad I was filming, oh my goodness, look, look I have a double balcony, oh wow, absolute wows, I just can't get over this. I need to have a tripod. I said to Paris, I need a tripod because you're not coming with me. So, haven't been able to vlog that much because it's just been so busy. But um, I'm going to make it up to you with this amazing vlog in Paris. 
it's a heat wave for the next few days. I'm here with Sicily, had met like a couple of girls that I've never met before in the industry. We're all, it's gonna be such a good trip. We're gonna meet and have like a rose downstairs. Um, a couple of them I already know, but if you're looking for a hotel in Paris, this is at the higher price point, but it's just amazing. I remember when I was decorating the house. Oh, we zoomed in. Um, this was actually where I like fell in love with, but obviously panelling is like world renowned. Everyone's been doing it for thousands of years, but this was the hotel where I just, yeah. This is where I got the idea for Honoré's room really, you can see with the two-tone. And I've actually got a picture on my home account with this door. I literally stood with this door and had a picture because it's just so beautiful. So, this was my travelling outfit, this Prada look I just live in with these shoes that I live in. It's so hot, so I'm going to spruce up my makeup, um, put some shorts on, and then we'll go back downstairs. Oh, I'm very pale. Um, spruced up my face because that was my 6am face. I'm very pale, why not? Um, eczema's been her like hideous. Um, I had to resort to putting some steroid cream on today so I could at least put some makeup on. That's how bad it is. Update with Marwa. I went to see Dr. Marwa. I had Botox. Then I was meant to have my laser, but I had to, we couldn't do the laser in the end the next day. So I'm going to be doing that again. So hopefully I can show you my face after laser but this is my outfit i've got to go downstairs and i really don't like being late um this is my outfit let me quickly show you um don't have a mirror in here we'll have to do it downstairs oh look at that reflection wow <gasps> i am now in hannah's room so it's a different view there's hermes there sent on array so I forced myself to wear this bright pink dress but I only pack in one evening outfit and I've done exactly what I knew I was going to do just get some light and I don't want to wear it and because I always just wear like all black I never wear all pink and I really really like it but when I tried it on I was really slim not really slim come on Claire but um yeah I'm like a lot more bloated today and I don't feel very nice I don't know, I just wish I'd never worn all pink. And a pink bag. I just wanted to force myself to wear something in a colour. Um, I will not be doing that again. I even feel like going downstairs and getting changed in like a white shirt and leggings. But anyway, beautiful view. And we're going for dinner at Gigi's. <laughs> I did catch her off guard. This is Hannah. Hi everyone. If you don't follow her, you'll love her. We're both wearing white dresses. There you go. Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. So I have no makeup on, just what? I have eyebrows, mascara, and the new Sicily lipstick. And actually, my skin here has been the best it's been in a long time. And um, it's in the bathroom, but it's the... Um, Sicily moisturizer that I actually have at home, which I haven't opened yet because I was getting through my last um, moisturizer, but I love this. I um, wore this dress last night, not gonna lie, like for two hours. I'm not wearing it today. I just wanted to get like um, one video of me walking along the street. Cringe, I know, but I just like, like the way that it moves. Change my shoes. Um, I bought these because how nice are they with like just denim? but they look so nice with this dress. I threw this dress in last minute and it's actually been amazing. I wore it with heels last night for dinner. Ooh. And um, it's really, really comfortable. And then my pajamas that were here last night when I got in. And then I'm just gonna wear this, which is my new um, Kate Cashmere, my go-to bag that just goes with everything. So yes, I'm going to go for breakfast and then I'll come back upstairs, I will pack and then I'm going for my Sicily facial. Stunning, right? So stunning. I hope you can hear me. So I just pulled up at the Sicily um, like head office. Uh, weather is glorious. I know I always give you a weather report when I'm travelling. I'm a bit hot in my cashmere but I just, um, I was trying to think of an excuse but basically I wanted to take a picture of this outfit. I'm going to be honest with you about these shoes because I've had, a, I've had a lot of people ask me saying that they're uncomfortable. They are 
not super duper comfortable so i don't know why anyone thinks they're uncomfortable they're actually extremely comfortable they're just they fall off a little bit but i do have skinny feet and hannah told me to buy grips and it'll be fine so i do recommend them this is my skin before people are looking at me um, and now i'm going to have my beautiful facial with sicily and um, I'm going to show you the results, but I'm already so impressed with the cream that I used last night. And I just feel like I can't wait to put my all day, all year cream on because of all the pollution. So let's go for the facial. Oopsie, wrong drawer. That's where we went yesterday for the presentation. Ah, yes, this is the spa. This is what we're here for. This is the all day, all year round. So what I love about this product is, and I've been only using it the last two days, but sometimes I find a great product and I panic where I can fit it into my routine. This you just add to whatever your routine is. It's There's like no competition on the market. It's very innovating and unique. Um, as you can see, it's anti-aging and protection against pollution and even indoors against blue light, microwave, this kind of thing. Um, but it also has SPF. It lasts for eight hours. So although the SPF is only 15%, the 15, sorry, it lasts for eight hours and increases collagen, protects from pollution. It's really good for like a primer before your makeup. So it's really sensational. I'm really excited about the increase in collagen and I really need to pay more effort, like protecting against pollution and it has the SPF all in one. So I'm really super excited to try this more. You like, you know I like to try things for a good two weeks. So that's what we're here for. Let me show you the other cream. Where is it? This is it here. This is a miracle worker. Let's go in the light. So if you're, if you follow me, you will know that I really struggle with my eczema and this cream, I thought, let me give it a go. I have, I actually have this because my eczema has been so bad lately. I've literally just been sticking to that, which is really great. Tried this. I was a bit worried because normally creams can react so easily with me and it's a miracle worker. It's absolutely I'm not even meant to be talking about this. This has nothing to do with the launch or the trip. But if you have really dry skin or sensitive skin, this is, you have to try it. And if you just have normal skin, it's going to work even better. So I had to share that with you. Now I'm going to pack. And that's that. I'm just packing and I wanted to show you these because um, I've been using these just over three weeks now. Um, this The Energy and Hair one. Um, the deep bloat one and then I have the sleep and calm because I really wanted to have a good night's sleep last night being on my own and the skin and digestion because I'm on my skin journey they're so amazing this brand um, really good for allergy information like I'll show you at the back it says does not does not contain which of you have really bad allergies like me that was what I first liked about this brand because it was a lot of vitamins they all include fish or nuts Especially if they're vegan, they'll they'll include nuts. Uh, so really feel confident using Jay's Jay's Health. And yeah, the hair one I've used for the longest, and I've really seen um, a difference, which I'm going to share on my stories. But I just wanted to share you these because I've been using them for a while now, and I think I'm getting to the point now where I feel like I can really see the result. I did ask them for a discount code, so I'm going to share that below. So if you're looking for vitamins. This one I think is so excellent. I was looking for one like sleep aid for a while, but not a sleeping tablet. I do the chamomile tea. I do like milky drinks. I try, I have the bath and I'm finding it hard to wind down. So this has been amazing.